I'll pronounce you husband and- Wait, I need you to do the flower test. Right now? Yes, I have to be sure. She loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. She loves me not. You don't love me. Why would you agree to marry me if you don't love me? I thought I did, but I wasn't sure. No, you knew. Because if you really love me, you wouldn't even have to think about it. Truthfully, there's someone else. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, that was embarrassing. I love you, Timmy. Brianna, I love you too. I've loved you since I was six years old. What? But I did the flower test and you didn't love me back. It must have been wrong. Try it again. The flower test doesn't lie. Please, just one more time. He loves me. He loves me not. I'm drinking pickle juice. And why not? You're having your first kiss in two hours. Come on. Who am I even going to kiss? I don't have a boyfriend. Garlic, really? Yes, it's really good for your immune system. But it's not good for kissing a boy. You have ten minutes until your first kiss. You want a bite? I'll pass. Onions have tons of antioxidants. And odor. Sardines, that's it. I'm done trying to help you. I never asked for your help. Hey, Brianna. I just wanted to tell you I've been in love with you since the second grade. I want to kiss you so bad. Come here. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, your breath! Birthmark came in. My what? Oh. It's kind of ugly. Your soulmate has the exact same one. When you touch it, you can feel what they're feeling. <laughs> How's your soulmate feeling? I think my soulmate's crying. I wonder how my soulmate's feeling. Ouch! I think my soulmate just got punched in the gut. Look at Cameron. He's so charming. I hope he's my soulmate. Brianna, your shoelaces are untied. Made you look! <laughs> 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 Why is my soulmate crying all the time? <laughs> Sad boy Steve is crying again. Yeah. What is the meaning of life? Wait a minute. Dancing in the mirror <laughs> and singing in the shower. My soulmate is Sad boy Steve. One million dollars or glasses? Obviously. Whoops. Hey. These don't even have lenses. Hey, best friend. Hey. I'm only friends with her because I think her dad is hot. Gross. Stay away from my dad. Spare change? Anyone have spare change? I was kicked out from home at only 14 years old. Here. This is all I have. Can no one clean up around here? I have to do everything myself. I'm really overwhelmed and burnt out from work. Mom, don't worry. I'll clean the house today. Good morning, Principal Stevens. Good morning, Brianna. I'm actually her real father. Hey now, you're a rock star. Get the show on. Get paid. Dad? I already know I'm gonna be a 10. <laughs> there. It's fixed. All is how it should be. No one will ever know. Look over there. She got a 10. That's so cool. Wow. I can't believe we have a 10 at our school. Look over there. It's a zero. Let's bully her. <sighs> Thank goodness it's not me. Yeah. Bully her. I love being a 10. Come on, Brianna, start running. No, no. Pretty girls don't run. They do if they want to pass gym class. Ugh. I hate running. The one smudged off. It was makeup. She's actually a zero. You were lying about your rating? Um, I, I can explain. I, uh... Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. He loves me? He loves me not. He loves me? He loves me not. You don't love me, Dad. Of course I love you. You're my daughter. Why'd you come back? Look, I need some money. I just need you to ask your mother. Not gonna happen. Why don't you go pick up milk like you said you were going to ten years ago? Hey, baby. Are you okay? I love you. Me? He loves me not. He loves me. I love you too. I now pronounce you husband and- Wait, I need you to do the flower test. Right now? Is mom gonna be okay? I don't know, she's in critical condition. Here, I'll give her some words. 
I don't understand. It's only letting me give all my words or nothing. Keep your words. I'll give her mine. No! I'm alive. Honey, is everything okay? Your eldest daughter gave you all her words so you could survive. She unfortunately passed away immediately. What? Are you just never going to use your words again? It's been five months since your sister's death. You need to move on. Why don't you ever speak? I heard you had almost a million words. You don't? Hello? Hello? I know you're lying. I know you have words. Hey, answer me. Answer me! Stop! It has to be her. And the little girl was adopted by a king and queen and became a princess. I hope one day I'll be adopted by a queen. <sighs> Good night, sissy. Emily, good news, you're getting adopted. Yay, sissy, we're finally gonna have a real home. You are, but I can't come with you this time. What? You have to come or I'm not going. Emily, wait. Where's Emily? Her new parents are here to meet her. I'm not sure, but don't worry, I'll find her. Hurry up. Emily? Oh. Emily, come out, your parents are here. Oh. Emily! Got this new beach hat. Let me try it. Mom, you cheated on Dad? How did you find out? Babe, I'm kind of cold. Here, you can borrow my sweater. You don't love me? Of course I love you. You're lying. I'll be your substitute teacher today. Miss Applewood, unfortunately, was murdered. Poor Miss Applewood. Oh my god, that's so sad. Emily, do you have a hair tie? Emily, you are way too young to be doing that kind of job. What? Did you hear what happened to Miss Applewood? It's so crazy. Yeah, it's so weird. Look at my new watch. Ooh, shiny. Only one blink today? You still haven't blinked? Just close your eyes. No way. I'm too young to die. Whoa, you're still alive? Wanna know how to get more blinks? Yes. Look over there. He can help you. Stinky Steve? Yeah, he knows how to get more blinks. But he smells like sh- Here, drink this potion. That was disgusting. Yeah, that wasn't the potion for more blinks. This is the real one. It better be. That potion tasted much better. Oh no, I blinked! No need to worry. You have infinity blinks now. Stinky Steve, I could just kiss you right now. So kiss me. Whoa, I wouldn't go that far. It was just a figure of speech. Can you actually lend me some more blinks? That was my only infinity blink potion. I can lend people blinks? We're given the wrong career by mistake. Your actual career is... The president? Look, the stripper's back. Think again. Oh, my apologies, Miss President. Hey, girly, I'm so sorry about what I said yesterday about you having no self-respect. Just, you know, remember me when you're president. Oh, I'll remember you. I'll remember you. Why'd you say it like that? I don't know. I guess you'll find out. Wait, you're not going to nuke me, are you? I can't believe it. My best friend is going to be president. I thought you said you couldn't be friends with someone like me. Come on, you knew I was joking. No, I didn't. Hello, I'm here to see Brianna. It's Joe Byron. Joe Byron's here? Come with me, Brianna. It's time. Silver, pray. Please don't do this. Guys, wait, stop. Look, underneath the blue, there's red. She's a hunter. We almost killed our own kind. I told you. I told you guys I was a hunter. Someone framed me. It was makeup. Someone must have put it on me when I was asleep. I found the security footage from when you were napping. Just a little concealer. This is what you get for being selfish and stealing all of my prey. When people think you're a prey, they're all going to come and hunt you. <laughs> I can't believe it. Another hunter tried to sabotage me. It's not what it looks like. I'll raise your hand if you wish for her to be banished from the hunter squad. It's unanimous. Wait, I object. Excuse me? Okay, I'll be the princess and you be the... Can I play too? No, we don't play with stinky losers like you. <laughs> Get out of here, stinky. 
Hey, Brianna, would you like to be my date to prom? Wait, you're really asking me? Of course I am. I'd love to. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe she actually bought it. You really thought I'd actually go to prom with you? Mom, I'm home from school. I got a call from the school. You're failing all of your classes? Mom. You really want to be an embarrassment to this family? Mom, it's... You're a pathetic excuse for a daughter. It's kind of hard to focus when I'm getting bullied every single day at school. Honey, I... I'm going to cover up these cracks. They need to know that they can't break me. There. No one will ever know. Happy 16th birthday. Blow out the candles. Let's see how long you have till you have to get married. Or else. <laughs> Oh, no. Two days? Happy birthday! How much time till you need to be married? Two days. Uh-oh. I know. There's no way I can find someone to marry in just two days. Hey, babe. You love me, right? Uh, yeah, of course. So marry me. I can't. I'm not ready to be married. I only have one day left to get married or else I'm gonna die. I'm sorry. Hey, Brianna, I just wanted to tell you I've had a crush on you since second grade. <laughs> so marry me. What? Come on, let's go. We'll go to the chapel right now. No, you're crazy. <gasps> Come back. I only have one hour left. Goodbye, bestie. I'll marry you. What? Whoa, you all right there, Timmy? You're lucky I was there to save you. You saved me. I love you. <laughs> I love you too, Timmy. We live. We love, we lie. Timmy, what are you seeing? That sounds terrible. Gibbity skibbity. Oh no, Timmy caught the mean disease. You have to keep your ears covered and get out of there. What are you saying? I can't hear you. Oh, I got him. We live. Come on. Memes are a very infectious disease. If you hear someone saying mean sounds, you must plug your ears and get out of there immediately, or else you could be infected forever. <laughs> hey, babe. Today it's officially been 10 years since my brother Timmy died. Because of the meme disease. <laughs> it's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? I said it's been 10 years already? Huh? Huh? Oh no. You caught the meme disease. How many lives did you get? 50. I can't wait to use them. Brianna, want to come try poison with me after school? I'd love to. Three, two, one. Brianna, want to come try drowning with us later? Yes, I've always wanted to try drowning. Aw, uh, I wish I could come, but I don't have enough lives. That's no problem. I'll send you some more lives. Want to come drink bleach with me later? I'm so down. Hey, Emily, are you coming? I'll send you some more lives. Sure. You need to stop using your lives so fast. You'll run out. Whatever, Mom. Just let me have fun. Let's all go jump up buildings after school. Yes, I can't. I only have one life left, but I can come watch. I'm gonna jump. Let me give you a push. Ah! Your turn. <laughs> no. Sorry. Sir, wait. You dropped this. A lottery ticket? Oh. My. I won the million. Here's your one million dollar check. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Oh, one million dollars. That's the guy who dropped the ticket. Sir, wait! Hi, you don't know me, but you dropped your lottery ticket. Oh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. No, you don't understand. It was the million dollar ticket. Wow, it really was the million dollar ticket. Here, take it. It was my fault for dropping it. The money's all yours. Are you sure about that? Actually, no, I'm not. Take me out on a date and we can call it even. I only need five more dollars to meet my soulmate. One million? Here, take this five dollars. I'm never going to make enough to meet my soulmate anyways. Dude, did you hear? She needs one million dollars to meet her soulmate. She's going to be forever alone. Shh, dude, she's looking this way. Hey, Brianna, you know if you're ever feeling lonely, you can always come and see me. Don't you have a soulmate waiting for you somewhere? Hey, Mom, how much money did you need to meet Dad? Only two dollars. Two dollars? I need one million. What? That's impossible. I wonder what my soulmate would have been like. Sorry. Sir, wait! You dropped this. Lottery ticket? Oh. My. 
Nurse or construction worker? I can't risk it. My mom's a nurse. Seriously, you just killed my dad. I'm so sorry. I didn't know. Our friendship is over. Bestie, wait! Did you hear? She killed her best friend's dad. She's so sick. <sighs> Get out of the way, loser. Hey! Unfortunately, one of your classmates passed away today. Brianna did it. She keeps choosing people to die all the time. Kick her out of the school! Honey, how was school? Horrible. Everyone hates me because of my curse. I'm so sorry. I just got another one. Teacher or a rapist? This is easy. Wait, don't choose yet. Oh, you look so beautiful today. Stop it, Johnny. Look at your hand, you got your mark. I got a pink mark. I'm going to be socially successful. Do you know what this means, Johnny? No. I'm going to be famous. All the famous celebrities have a pink mark, like Kylie Jenner or Ariana Grande. Did you get your mark yet? Hold on, I just need to finish this paper. Look at your hand, you got a blue mark. <gasps> blue? I'm going to be academically successful. Harvard, here I come. Harvard, here I come. Did you look to see if you got your mark yet? No, I haven't yet. What color did you get? I didn't see it. I got pink. Yay, we're twins. Yeah, I have to go. Can't believe it. I'm going to be a failure. Honey, come downstairs. I want to see your mark. There. It's covered. As far as anyone knows, I have a pink mark. What did you just do? Hello? Help. Help. Let me in. Someone's chasing me. <laughs> Please. Don't let her in. Hurry. They're chasing me. Who? Who's chasing you? I don't know. Some crazy people wearing masks. Are they close? No. They're far away. Hurry. She's lying. Open up, they found me! <laughs> you are coming with me. Ah, help! Help! Mom, where are you? When are you coming home? I'm 15 minutes away. I'm stuck in traffic. Tell her not to come. Don't let her come. Mom, you can't come home right now. Why not? You just can't. Just don't come. Hey, baby. How are you feeling? Chad, how did you get in here? Your window was open. Be careful. Oops, I dropped my... I'll get it. Chad, why do you have a mask? Because you're next. Please give me something cool. You can see people's locations? That's kind of creepy. What'd you get? I can see people's locations. Can you please check where your sister Emily is? Where's my sister? She's at a party. No way. She's going to be in so much trouble. I gotta go to school. Where's my boyfriend? He hasn't texted me all day. Where's Brittany's boyfriend? He's at Jennifer's house. No way. I always knew he had a thing for Jennifer. Um, I'm home from school. Hey, honey, can you please check where your dad is? Where's dad? He's at the grocery store. He must be getting more milk. Hello, everyone. I'm home. Dad, you're supposed to be at the grocery store. I can't believe you have an Intelligence Corp 100. You are so cool. Look at this article. You're getting praised everywhere. You're the first person in the world to reach an Intelligence Corp 100. So now, because I have an Intelligence Corp 100, everyone all of a sudden respects me? Good morning, everyone. I'd like you all to meet our new hires. Are you serious? These are the new hires? Their Intelligence scores are extremely low. Hey, boss, why did you hire a bunch of new staff that are, well, to put it lightly, dimwits? Have you spoken to any of them? No. Well, then I would like to ask you to speak with one of them, and I can assure you the staff I hire are very intellectual. <laughs> oh, my. Woo, party! Boss, all these dimwits you hired threw a party, and they're destroying the office. Ooh, this is so pretty. No, don't! <laughs> What have I done? Brianna, what rhymes with mother? That is so messed up. <laughs> mommy. Emily, stop crying. I'm trying to think. I want mommy. Mommy's gone, okay? She's gone and she's never coming back. Brother. Correct. <laughs> hey, Emily, I'm sorry I acted that way. I'll walk myself to school today. Don't follow me. Emily. Bree, you good? My mom couldn't rhyme the word this morning, and my sister won't even talk to me. So yeah, I'm not doing great. Brianna, what rhymes with sister? Miss her. Correct. Man, that's tough. Here, do my assignment for me.
Brittany, what rhymes with assignment? Nothing rhymes with assignment because assignment isn't even a real word. Assignment is most definitely a real word. Assignment? Hmm. Come on, Brittany, use your brain. I don't need to use my brain because I'm pretty. Pretty. Brianna, something happened to your sister. Brianna, what rhymes with lost? Here's your paycheck. That's it? Are you kidding me? I've been working every single day like a dog. I'm sorry, but waitressing isn't a dangerous job. I made $5,000 today. No way. What kind of job do you have? I swim with sharks. I need a new job. My paycheck just isn't going to cut it. I overheard that you need a job. So you're eavesdropping on me? I'll pay you 100 k to pretend to be my girlfriend in front of my father. Deal. I'm getting paid 100 k to pretend to be someone's girlfriend. Um, Brianna, if you're going to pay that much, it must be really dangerous. How dangerous could being someone's girlfriend be? Look, there's one thing I want to tell you before you meet my father. Look, don't even sweat it. I know how to make a good impression. Hello, sir. Hello. Hi, Mom. I'm off to school. Don't go to school. Don't go. Actually, I'm not going to school today. I feel sick. Hello? Brianna, are you okay? Are you somewhere safe? Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't go to school today. Well, it's a good thing you didn't. There were masked intruders at our school. Some people didn't make it out safely. And the worst part is, the police haven't caught them yet. One second. Chad's calling. Hey, baby. I miss seeing you today. Yeah, I missed you too, baby. Am I still coming over? No, don't let Chad come over. Chad, it's actually best if you don't come today. But I want to see you. I miss... Hello? Help. Help! Let me in! Someone's chasing me! Please! Don't let her in! Mommy? What are you looking at? Um... Sugar... Dad... What's a sugar daddy? It's a type of candy! Aw, I wish I had a sugar daddy! No! Yay! Look, it's sugar daddy girl! Come on, I was five! And at least my man will have money. I can't believe she just said that. Mom, is there any way to change my wish? I'm getting bullied at school. I'm sorry, honey. You only get one wish. You'll just have to live with it. Here's your test back. Brianna, can you come see me after class? Sure. Look, sir, if this is about the test, I promise next time I'll study. It's not. And you can call me Darren. Mom, I'm home. What? How is that possible? I only have 17 marks. Look who just turned 18. Yeah, I guess I am. Let me see your new mark. No, you're not 18. You only have 17 marks. That's so weird. I got my 18th mark. I must not be 18 yet. Look at us. We're 18 now. Wait, where's your 18th mark? I, I got my mark. It just didn't show up. I guess I'm not meant to be 18 yet. Did you hear? Her 18th mark never showed up when she got it. She's still 17. That's not even possible. Brianna? Uh, yes? Please go to the office. There's someone here to see you. Ooh, she's in trouble. Do you even know what you've done? You've messed with time as we know it. No one in the history has missed getting their mark. There's major consequences for this. What's going to happen is... Time for your fifth mark. Yay, I'm so excited. I'm finally going to be five. Congratulations! Yay, me! Time for your 10th mark. Finally. I'm so excited to grow up. And you're all done. It's time for your 17th mark. You're going to be an adult next year. There. You're officially 17. Now you only have one year to figure out what you're going to do for the rest of your life. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. It's almost time for our yearly mark. Have you applied to any schools yet? No, I haven't decided yet. Well, now's the time to figure it out. We're getting our marks tomorrow. We're going to be adults. All right, it's time for your 18th mark. I hope you're ready for adulthood. Actually, I have to use the washroom. I'll be right back. What would happen if I don't get my 18th mark? Would they even notice I'm gone? I'm not going back there. Whew. Well, I guess that makes sense. My soulmate wouldn't be hiding in my bedroom. It still hasn't gone up yet. Hi, Brianna. Derek, hi! Guess you're not my soulmate. What? Mom, I'm home from school. 
No way. My soulmate's near my house? Honey, your sister will be coming over with her new fiancé. You can finally meet him. That's great! <laughs> so loud! It's too loud in here! Hi, I'm Chad. It's great to finally meet you. Bye, Mother. I'm off to school. Wait right there. I see your mark is uncovered. I told you you can never leave this house with your mark uncovered. I ran out of concealer. Well, I guess there's no school today, then. But, Mother, I have an exam! Honey, please understand I'm doing this because I love you. If people see your mark, they'll start to ask questions, and then they'll take you away from me forever. Do you understand? Okay, mother. Just an X. No one will even notice. I have to go write my exam. Hey, miss. I'm so sorry I'm late. Can I still write my exam? What's that on your neck? Oh, yeah. It's it's just the birthmark. Yeah. It's the birthmark of the long-lost royal daughter. You must be the princess. What? Would you go online knowing you have an X? I thought maybe I wouldn't get caught. Of course you would get caught. Who are you? You have an X too? So, where are you taking me? This is the X's hiding spot. I made it my personal duty to protect all X's. Wow, you're pretty heroic. Excuse me, miss. May I sit here? Yes, of course you can. Why would she have an X? She's just a baby. The X's were given at random. No reason and no sympathy. <laughs> Oh no, they found us. We have to leave immediately. You have no money, you poor foster child. That's not true. My mommy and daddy are at home waiting for me. She got a mark. She's lying. <laughs> Welcome students to the Mother's Day celebration. Uh, Honey, where's your mother? She'll be here. She's just running late. She got a mark. She has no mother. Jennifer, that's not a nice thing to say. <gasps> Do you really wish to leave foster care and become fully independent at only 16? I do. As you can see, our numbers are down 20% compared to last month then. Should we really trust a CEO with that many marks on her face? If you would like to chit chat, you may excuse yourself from this meeting. I finally found you! Excuse me? I'm your mother. No, you're not. But a mark. That means you. It's really dangerous here. Let's go somewhere private and talk. Yeah, sure. No one's around. I think we'll be safe here. Yeah. So, what did you need to talk about? I'm so sorry I have to do this. What are you doing? I have to do this. I have to kill you. I only have two tasks left. That money is mine. No! <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'll call you an ambulance. I'm not going anywhere until I finish my task. <laughs> Well, I've made it this far. Mm -hmm. well, I might as well be the one who finished all these tasks. Why aren't you eating lunch? I didn't bring anything. Here, you can have one of my cookies. They're my favorite. Thank you. What's wrong? I flunked my math test. You look like you need a cookie. Here. Thank you. I have an extra special cookie for you. Seriously, John, I'm honestly getting sick of those. Please, just have one for me. Okay. What's this? Will you marry me? Yes! Yes, of course, yes! Um, are you feeling okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Just a little under the weather today, that's all. Thank you. These are my favorite. Today, we remember the life of Jonathan Smith. Jonathan, I brought you the cookies you like. They're your favorite. Good morning, class. Did everyone receive how they'll die? Yes, I got mine. I'm gonna die from food poisoning. Um, mine says I'm gonna be murdered by my teacher? Okay, class. It's probably best if we don't share our cause of death with the class. What the? Hey, what's yours? The teacher said it's best if we don't tell anyone about it. Fine, whatever. Don't tell me then. Class, we have a new student. Everyone please welcome Edward C. Do you have any idea what's going on in this class? Yeah, of course I do. Do you think you could stay a couple minutes after class and help me out? Let's make this quick. I want to go home. 
Hi, Jor. 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 Hi, Jor.
What the? What the hell is going on? Hey, sweet thing, you want to take me to Taco Bell? No, it smells like you just came from there. <laughs> Got it. Boy! Dad! What's wrong? This kid bullied me today. What? Are you serious? Yeah, just because I stuck up for you. What do you mean? He said my dad's weak. I said, no, Mo will beat yours up. No other dad can beat me up. I know, that's why he's here in the other room, warming up. What? He's here? <laughs> I'm gonna go kiss some, uh, uh, some milk real quick, I. Right? Okay, hurry! Hit your son for five million dollars. My big bullshit, ready to get it started. I got this. Hey, hey, son. Uh-huh? Son, wake up, wake your ass up, boy. What happened? Why's my face hurt? Let's go get you a PS5. PS5? Excuse me. Hi. Would you rather take this five dollar bill or double it and give it to the next person? I'll take it. No, you can't do that. You literally just asked me if I wanted to keep five dollars. Yeah, but you're not supposed to keep it. Then why would you ask me? Stop recording. Look, kid, you're supposed to double it and give it to the next person because you're a good person. So to be a good person, I'm supposed to give away free money? Yes, someone might need it more. But what if you give the money to someone who isn't a good person or is rich? It doesn't matter. That's how the game works. I don't want to play. I want the money. Let's try this one more time. Would you rather take this $5 bill or double it and give it to the next person? If I double it, can I be the next person? Oh, great heaven! Look at Mr. Garcia. I bet he gets no girls. <laughs> <laughs> He's coming. Pretend like you're working. Why were you guys laughing? Oh, um, Mark told me a funny joke. Oh, yeah? What was the joke? What always begins with a W and ends with a T? What? <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I'll let you guys continue what y'all were doing. That was a close one. How'd you come up with that joke? My dad. Oh, wait, Monica, I want to show you this real quick. Uh, okay. Yeet! What? Yeet! What was that? You better quit before you get your ass beat. You're gonna talk about what happened at school? No. What did you tell your teacher that got you in trouble? I told her the truth. Like what? She wanted me to get in front of the class to solve a problem. Okay, and? I told her I can't. She said, why? I stood up and said, because I have a... A what? It rhymes with loner. Loner? Oh. And then she got really mad when I said, Miss Davis, since it's your fault, can you help me bring it down? No, you didn't. Yeah, because mom always helps you bring yours down. Oh, great heaven! Dad, I gave it some time, and I think this time it's gonna work. Son, what are you talking about? Make it Addison Ray, my stepmom. I'm done with these. They're not gonna work. Just listen. Yeah, whatever. So this is what you're gonna tell her. Okay. Okay, what's up, eh? I'm gonna make you my wifey. I got a cute son that will make you go crazy. So pretty, pretty, please, can you be his stepmom? You'll make you forget that you had an ugly husband. Hold up. Pause. Ugly husband? Yeah, you. Boy! <laughs> Oh, Dad, I won an iPhone in the race today. For real? Nice. How many people were there? Just me and two other people. Okay, just three of y'all. Who were the other two? Um, it's best that you don't know. What? Boy, you better tell me right now. You gonna get this hand? I'm about to ruin my dad's whole career. The phone owner and the police. <laughs> get it hey why are you here i miss you i told you it's over i can't do this anymore you need me baby go away no ah do we have a problem here buddy no one touches my stepsis except for me any last words kid i'm gonna have fun with this one back to prison i go oh great heaven <laughs> So tell me, why'd you start drinking? Okay, well, it all started when I got married. Okay. I married a girl that had a daughter, so then I had a stepdaughter. Okay. So my dad ended up marrying my stepdaughter. What? So now my stepdaughter is also my stepmother. Oh.
Then we had a kid. So now my son is my dad's brother-in-law. Hold on, what? So he's the half-brother of my stepdaughter, who's also his wife. I'm confused. So that means my wife is my step-grandma. Huh? Because she's my stepmother's mother. Hold on, it gets better. So now I'm my wife's grandson and grandfather at the same time. Oh, great heavens! I need a drink. Give me my whole body. Just please don't tell nobody. I pull up in that... Just to get back to that. Grandpa, are the plates clean? They're as clean as cold water can get them. Just eat your meal. The next meal. Gramps, are you sure the plates are clean? How many times do I have to tell you? Those dishes are clean as cold water can get them. A couple minutes later. Grandpa, your dog keeps growling at me. Cold water, come here. Oh, great heaven. What the? What's that noise? Uh, oh my gosh! Oh no, mommy and daddy are in trouble. They need my help. Don't hurt my mommy and daddy. No, don't come in. You're an artist. Yeah. Are you good at it? Hey, so I'm basically gonna copy everything you do. I'm gonna annoy you. Everything you get in trouble for, I'm gonna get away with. I'm basically the favorite child. Oh, and if you don't let me play the game, I'm gonna tell mom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Tell me my bag. Yeah. Hey, Michaela. Hey, handsome. You down to play a game? You know I'm always down. <laughs> That's why I love you. Oh. So it's gonna be a staring contest, but the loser has to make love with the winner. Oh, okay. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Dang, I lost. You know what that means? Yeah, you have to. Get this hand. Oh. Bro, there was this one time I failed a test and the teacher wanted me to get it signed and I forged mom's signature. What? No way. One time I asked mom to stay the night at my friend's house, but I actually stayed over my girlfriend's place. Dang, that's crazy. Hey. What's up? Look who it is. Hold up. How long have you been there? The whole time. Please, Please don't, don't tell, tell mom. mom. I ain't doing it for free. Bro, no way. Mom. Okay, okay. I'll let you play the game whenever. And you? I'll give you $10 for lunch money. Make it 20 Oh, fine. It was fun doing business with y'all. Mom, you won't believe what Dumb and Dumber said. Hey, class, we need to have a talk. In my 30 years of teaching, never have I received a note this bad from a substitute. I leave for one day, and all of a sudden, y'all don't know how to act? What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong as a teacher? There's 24 people in the class, and only two of you guys turned in the assignment. Do I need moms to babysit? Mark and Lista, put your hands down. I don't want to hear it because your names are on the list. Walking out of class without permission? Who was selling chips in class? Unbelievable. I'm going to be calling each and one of your guys' moms that are on the list. Oh, yeah. And that pizza party? Canceled. Oh, great heaven. Teacher, teacher. What's wrong? I think the world is ending. Is this one of your silly pranks? No, I'm being for real. The zombies are already here. Let them come. You're not scared? No, because we have them. Let's do this. Oh, da! My time to shine. Oh, great heavens! A father was listening to his daughter pray. God bless mommy. God bless daddy. God bless grandma. Goodbye, grandpa. Honey, why did you say goodbye, grandpa? I don't know, daddy. It just felt right. The next day, her grandpa dies, and the father just thought it was a strange coincidence. A week later, the dad was listening to his daughter pray again. God bless mommy. God bless daddy. Goodbye, grandma. The next day, the grandma died. The father started thinking, wow, my daughter must be very special. A week later, he was listening to his daughter pray again. God bless mommy. Goodbye, daddy. He started freaking out and couldn't sleep all night. He left early and went to his office. He was nervous all day and kept watching the clock. He felt safe in his office and figured if he could make it to midnight, he would be okay. Once it hit midnight, he went home. When he went home, his wife said, I've never seen you work so late. What's the matter? I had the worst day of my life. Yeah, well, my day was worse. The mailman dropped dead on our porch. Oh, great heavens! Girl, you know I like you and shit, but you be playing with me. Oh, really? What do you like about me? Shit, I don't know. Your nose? Oh, gee, tripping. <clears throat> hey, um, did you get the notes for last class? Uh, no, I didn't. Sorry. Hey, what you said to my girl? Oh, oh, I was just asking her for the notes. I wasn't here yesterday. You trying to flirt with my girl or something? 
Ba babe, calm down. Nah, I was just trying to get the notes from her. What notes you need from her? Why you ain't ask me for the notes? Nah, jig, crazy. Dog, you're not even in my class. You're not in my class? So what you trying to do with her? Babe, chill out. I'm just trying to pass the class. Hey, watch out. Nah, Jig got problems. I know young boy's favorite rapper. That's crazy. Yo, son. Yeah, what's up? Did you call our neighbor Miss Lewis a bitch? Yeah. Why? Because she changed the Wi-Fi password. Boy, you can't be calling... That bitch changed the Wi-Fi password? Oh, na na, just be careful, na na. Love ain't simple, na na. Promise me no promises. Oh, na na, just be careful, na na. Love ain't simple, na na. Promise me. Just like that, you try. Oh, I can't do it. Where are you going? I quit. I practice and practice and I still can't get it. It'll never happen. One day you'll get it. I promise. Yeah, whatever. Ten years later. One day you'll get it. I promise. I told you. What was that? Um, my brown sponge. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, no, Mom, can I use your brown sponge to clean this? I'm sorry, honey, I lost it. Oh, okay. Later that night. Mom, I found your brown sponge. Wait, what? Our neighbor, Miss Rodriguez. Dad was using it to wash his face. Oh, wow. Yo, son, they canceled school tomorrow. Why? What happened? I think your teacher died or something. Wow, they found the body already? Oh, great heavens! Oh, wow. Uh... Get this ugly kid. He probably never gets girls. I was with one last night. Huh? That's Pat. Ask your sister. This is how you know you're Catherine, because I don't have one. I'm about to ruin this bully's whole career. You will in nine months. <laughs> Hey, you dumb loser nerd. Why are you looking at me like that? Are you gay? I'm about to destroy this bully's whole career. Why, are you looking for a boyfriend? Bust down, Latina. They don't want to see you bust down. Pick it up y tíralo. Despacito y suavecito. For the gang. I got two... Phones, one for the plug and one for the load. I got two. Hey, Mom, can I have my phone back? Mom, can I at least be cool for 15 seconds? I'm making it musically. No, I need my phone back. Fine. Beautiful. Hey! I heard you like JB. I do. Well, I could be your JB. Just listen. Okay. Do you need somebody to love? I, I think I know who. Like somebody that's me, somebody that's me. You don't need no one else. I promise, girl, I swear. Tonight, let's get crazy and make love. You gonna make love with this hand? <laughs> I'd like to buy some perfume for my wife for Christmas. Oh, okay. Well, this one is our best seller. How much is it? $50. That's a lot. Do you have anything cheaper? How about this one? For $30. Um, that's still too much. This one's $15. What I really mean is, can you show me something that's really, really cheap? Well, then, here. Oh, what happens? Dad, I know you can't do these numbers with your hands. Easy. All right, Club Godzilla, I ain't tricking. I'm just dicking bitches down, <laughs> head down. Pop that, pop that, pop that pussy to the ground. Yo, Dad. What do you want now? I think I came up with a good idea to make Addison my stepmom. You still going on about this? Well, yeah, you need help. Shut your mouth. So what is it? So you walk up to her and you say... Need a freak, need a freak, mouth wide. Need a freak, need a freak, mouth wide. Do you even know what you just said? No, not really, but I heard it on TikTok. Boy, she will slap me like I'm about to do to you. Dad, I got something serious to tell you. What's up? I know I might not seem like I love you at times. But... <sighs> but I don't care what they say. Yeah. I'm in love with not you, because you always giving me the hand. Well, maybe if you weren't being a troublemaker... Well, I can't help it. I get it from you. No, you don't. And what is that? You mean this? Yes. Your Miss Lotion, of course. I've been using all day. You better use this hand. Ah! 
Hey, babe. Hey, where you at? I'm in the car. Is your dad there? No, he forgot his wallet, so he'll be back soon. Oh, okay. So we have a couple minutes to ourselves, and I just want to tell you, I'm not feeling myself today. Oh, what's wrong? Can I feel you instead? Oh, my gosh, you're so freaky. You know me. Yeah. Get your freak on. Yeah. Get your freak on. Yeah. Get your, get your, get your, get your, get your freak on. Ah. What the hell's going on in here? Hey. I was just getting my freak on. You about to get your freak on with this hand. Ah. Ah. Hi, excuse me? Yeah, what's up? Oh my gosh, my crush is talking to me. She's the most popular girl in school. Can I tell you something? Um, yeah, of course. I really, really like you. I'm about to end this boy's whole career. Hey, son, did my package come? Yeah, the mailman brought it in and gave it to mom early in y'all's room. He came in the house? Yeah, and I think mom and him are friends because they were wrestling under the covers like what you and mommy do. What? Yeah, and I think he was winning because mom was yelling, and whenever she wrestles you, you're the one yelling. Oh, great heavens! Oh, uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, uh. Yo, what's going on? You gonna tell him? Where your son tried to fight the mailman. What? Yeah, and he's lying and won't tell me why. I have an idea. Every time he lies, this makes a bird sound. Son, so why did you fight the mailman? I didn't. Okay, because he looked up and down on mom and I didn't like it. Well, there you go. And then he told me if I was his son, he would put me in military school. Well, good thing he's not your father. Hey, Dad, do you have a leak in your room? You be asking some weird questions, but no why. I overheard you and your friend last night. What'd I say? It's so wet, like the ocean. I touched huh? it. It was splashing. I put it in. I'm finished. Your what? friend said, huh, you finished? You were like, yeah, I couldn't help it. She was like, bye, I'm leaving. Why are you making fun of me? <laughs> Every time you lie, this lie detector is going to make a beep sound. So did you sneak out the house last night? No, I was asleep. Beep. I meant to say I went to the park with my friends. Beep. All right, all right. I really went to Michaela's house to Netflix and chill. Come on, son. When I was your age, I was a good kid. I would never do any of that. Beep. <laughs> he really is your son, huh? Beep. Oh, great heavens. Hey, this is the last time I'm asking you. Clean your room or I'm taking that game away. Okay, okay. Thank you. Let me put my headphones on. If she throw it back for a nigga, if she throw it back for a nigga, Michael Mary, Michael Mary, Billy Jean, Billy Jean, uh, Cause in the old deal, I'm in Ben the stores. When it rains, it pours, she let the wind in her. Oh, great heavens! Hey, Dad. What's up? Me and Michaela are doing a dance for a talent show. You want to see this? Ooh, let me see. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Nah, nah, yeah. I ain't never been with a body. She can't, so I added to the tally. Madison Button and I'm Maddie. Yes. Like, Max try to send me the alley. Like, What's the right that I left for the alley? Like, uh -huh. Joe, you don't look too shabby. Good nah. nah. thing come from the valley. Yes. Nah, I just want to play with that funny. Wow, that was great. Where can I get the song? It's in the bio. I'm about to go check it out so I can learn the dance. Maybe you and Mom can learn it so we can have a dance battle. <laughs> Y'all don't want the smoke. Hey class, we're going to play a game again where you remove the third letter of your name. Are you thirsty? I have water. Hi, doctor. What? I have a SED? Hey, girl. You want to like... <laughs> I think I just wet myself by looking at you. He escapes prison after 15 years, then breaks into a house to look for money. He finds a couple in bed, orders the guy out of bed, and ties him to a chair. The escaped prisoner then ties the wife to the bed and jumps on top of her, and it looks like he kissed her, then gets up and goes to the bathroom and closes the door. While he's in the bathroom, the husband whispers over to his wife, Hey, he's an escaped convict. Look at his clothes. He's probably spent a lot of time in jail and hasn't seen a woman in years. I saw the way he kissed your neck. If he wants anything, don't resist, don't complain, just go with it. Be strong, honey, and I love you. His wife looks at him, smiles, and says, He wasn't kissing my neck. He was whispering in my ear. He told me that he likes men and thinks you're cute and asked me where the Vaseline was. I told him it was in the bathroom. Be strong, honey, and I love you. Oh, great heavens! Oh, I can't beat this level! Give it to me. Okay. Done. Thank you, cousin. 
Hey, loser. Leave me alone. Have you ever kissed a girl? No. <laughs> Everyone, look. It's Mr. Virgin. <laughs> Later that night. Daddy, can I not go to school tomorrow? Why? This kid made everyone laugh by calling me Mr. Virgin. Oh, he did? Yeah. Well, you're going to school. What? And you're going to tell him this. The next day. Hey, look. It's Mr. Virgin. I was until last night. I don't believe you. Ask your sister then. Ha! <laughs> I don't have a sister. You will in nine months. Oh, great heavens! Hey, Dad, what's that thing in your pants? What? Oh, um, it's for pulling your parachute in case you fall out of a plane or you need to skydive. Oh, okay. Later that night. Dad, 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 Uncle Fred is about to jump. What? From where? I don't know, but I saw Mom pulling his parachute. Oh, great heavens! Oh, uh. Come on, come on. <gasps> yes. Son, it's your bedtime. You need to go to bed. Okay, I'll be done soon. I'm gonna get your dad if you don't. Whatever. Okay. A few moments later. Yo, son, what are you doing? Your mom said it was your bedtime. I'm playing Mobile Legends Bang Bang, and they have a collab with Transformers. And I just want to beat it. I'm getting so close. Boy, you better go to bed or else. Hey, you can keep playing just because I love Mobile Legends Bang Bang. Just keep it down and turn the lights off so Mom won't know. Huh. Now that's what I call a legend. Hey, son, you want to go play some catch? No, I'm not in the mood. Oh, okay. You all right? You seem kind of down. Last night, my girlfriend let another guy take her out. Dang, really? Yeah, I really want to fix this. What are you going to do about it? Tonight, I'm going to take her out. That's a good idea. Where? At her house. Her house? Oh, great heavens! Boy, you better tell me why you got in trouble in school. I was supposed to do a presentation about family, so I took this USB because I thought it was family pictures of us. Where'd you find that? In Mom's drawer. Please tell me you didn't show that. I did, and I got in trouble for showing it. I'm sorry, son. Sometimes me and your mom like to make our own movies. But, Dad, it was a movie of Mom and the Mailman. Hold on, what? Bye, Mommy! Bye, Mom. Have fun, kids. I'll just be here listening to my tunes. Drugs got me fucked up, sluts got me fucked up. You're for a whole month with no Fortnite. A whole month? Mm -hmm. You sit right there and think about what you did. Ugh. Yo, son, what was your mom yelling at you? She caught me sneaking out my girl through the front door. The front door? Yeah. That's the most rookiest mistake ever. You're supposed to do it out the window, son. I thought you'd be mad. I'd be less mad, I can tell you that. Oh. Back in my days, or even until this day. Dad, no. I would sneak them in and out. Dad. I know I'm really good at it. Dad. Oh, she's behind me, huh? Yeah. Mom, guess what? What, sweetie? I saw Dad put his wedding ring back on when he got home. Oh, really? Tell me this again during dinner time. Okay. Later that night. Sweetie, what were you telling me earlier? I saw Dad put his wedding ring on when he got home, just like Mom does when she goes to Uncle Fred's house. Emotional damage. <laughs> hey, son, I came as fast as I can. Who died? <laughs> My crush. Now I'll never know if she would let me take her on a date. I'm pretty sure she's down. <laughs> uh, you know, I think she's deeply in love with you. <laughs> oh, I went too far, huh? Hey, love, where are you? I'm at home chilling. I don't believe you. Go turn on the blender. Okay. There. Okay, love you. Hey, where are you? At home. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Turn on the blender then. Ugh. Okay, love you, bye. Son, you need to go to bed, it's getting late. Uh, I don't want to. Mark, can you take out the trash and put your son to bed? Yeah, sure. Let me give him a good night kiss. Mark, why is the trash in our son's bed? Huh? Hey son, I got an email from your teacher and you're suspended for the next three days for grabbing footballs? Like, what does that even mean? I know it sounds stupid. So basically during PE class, my teacher, Miss Bendover, told me to grab footballs. Okay. And when I did that, the whole class stopped and was looking at me weird. And then the teacher got really mad and sent me to the office. What? That doesn't even make any sense. Trust me, I feel the same way. I hate Miss Bendover. Hold on, my classmate is calling me. 
Hey, what's up, Foot? I'm so sorry about today. Oh, great heavens! I should have used protection. Dad, I need help! What's up? I forgot to take the meat out! Nah, you're on your own. What? Hey, sweetie. Mommy, I forgot to take the meat out. Grammy the belt. Did you say pillow? No, the belt. Here. Now turn around. You're joining us for dinner, sweetie. Mm-hmm. Well, you kind of made me or else I was going to get a whooping. You're always on that game, son. Dad, are bugs okay to eat? Whoa, why would you ask me that while we're eating dinner? Ask me later. A few moments later. Okay, since we're done eating... What'd you ask me? Oh, never mind. There was just a bug in your suit, but now it's gone. Oh, great heavens! Son, remember to never take off those headphones. Okay, Dad, I won't. Hey, loser. You look so ugly wearing those headphones. Hey, leave them alone. <laughs> Don't listen to them. They're idiots. Thank you. Don't worry, I got you. But why do you wear those all the time? Well, my dad told me to never take them off. Oh, okay. Hey, class, we're taking a pop quiz. Hey, no cheating. Take those headphones off. He can't hear you. Okay, I'll do it myself. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Wake up, filthy. Happy birthday, Mom. Thanks, sweetie. How old are you now? Like 40? What? You think I look that old? Well, how old is Dad? Your dad's the old one. He's 45, and I'm 32. Wait a second. If Dad's 45 and you're 32, and I'm 17... That means... Oh, great heavens! Hey, sweetie, dinner's ready. Oh, what, you spill something, sweetie? <laughs> don't worry, I ain't gonna tell on you. But that's why your mom says no food or drinks in the room. That way you don't make a mess. Let me help you. Oh, uh, no, no, it's no spill. See, see, it's dry. So what, what you put the towel down for in the bed, huh? It's that time of the month. I'm sorry, sweetie. Hmm? Oh, yep. Mm-hmm. Sure is. So I'm probably just gonna be in my room the rest of the night, Dad. Good night. Good night, sweetie. Good night, Mr. Howard. Oh, good night, Joshua. Hey, son, did you learn anything in school today? No. No? Did you at least do something fun? Um, no. Nothing? Hmm. <laughs> oh, actually, you know what? We... My wife? Told me to pick up six cans of Sprite at the grocery store. When I got home, I realized I'd picked seven of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great heavens!